Hello everyone. Welcome to Syllogisms Part Two. Syllogism Part One. Lo, mano, end discusses on types of statements and next immediate inference types of inferences and immediate inference. Just to recall them, there are four types of statements: universal affirmative, particular affirmative, universal negative, particular negative. Universal affirmative one day, all cats are dogs. Particular affirmative, some cats are dogs. Universal negative, no cat is dog. Particular negative, some cats are not dogs. Okay, three immediate and three inferences. First one anti immediate inference. Second one anti immediate inference. Immediate inference anti actually derive the conclusion from single statement. If the statement is universal affirmative, we have two immediate inferences. If the statement is all cats or dogs. Two immediate inferences are some cats or dogs. Some dogs are cats. If the statement is particular affirmative, that is some cats or dogs. What is the immediate inference? Some dogs are cats. Next, if the statement is universal negative, we have three immediate inferences. No cat is dog. That is the statement. What are the immediate inferences? No dog is cat. Some cats are not dogs. Some dogs are not cats. And what is the next one? Particular negative. What is the particular negative? Some cats or not dogs. What is the immediate inference? There is no immediate inference for particular negative. Okay. Now, uh, in this video, I am going to explain immediate inference. Immediate inference and in Japan, if we derive the conclusion from two statements, that is called as immediate inference. एक अड मीडियट इन्फ्रेंस सेसे मुंडो मान फर्स्ट तेलियल्स ने डेंटे व्हाट इज़ द डिस्ट्रीब्यूटेड प्रॉपर्टीज़ अधि चाला इम्पोर्टेंट डिस्ट्रीब्यूटेड प्रॉपर्टीज़ का तेलिसे डेंटे नो नीड टू ड्राइव वन डायग्राम नो नीड टू ड्राइव वन डायग्राम व्हाट इज़ द फर्स्ट स्टेटमेंट दैट All cats are dogs, right? What is the universal affirmative? All cats are dogs. Here, what is the subject? Cats is the subject and dogs is a predicate. Now, uh, what is the distributed property? Now, suppose this is a cat. And this is a dog. Suppose this is a cat and this is a dog. Okay. Now, if I want to expand this cat, if I want to expand this cat up to this is valid. This is a valid. This is valid, and this is also valid. But beyond the dogs is not a valid. Beyond the dogs is not a valid. That means here cat is distributed under the dogs. Cat is distributed under the dogs. And whatever the dog, you can expand any anywhere. But there is no limitation. If the limitation is not exist, then the Term is not satisfy the distributed property. That means dogs is not distributed. In the universal affirmative, subject is distributed, but predicate is not distributed. In the universal affirmative, subject is distributed, but predicate is not distributed. What is the next statement? That is the particular affirmative. What is the next statement? That is a particular affirmative. What is the particular affirmative? That is some cats or some cats or dogs. Now we will check what is the distributed property. Here, what is the subject? Subject is cats, and what is the predicate? That is a dog. Okay. Suppose some cats or dogs 
here we can represent like this this is the cats and this is the dogs now if i want to expand cat then what happen is uh, at uh, at what level if you write down cat if i expand like this then what happen there is no limitation if i expand like this there is no limitation that means here the some cats or dogs if you want to expand cats at anywhere there is no limitation if there is no limitation that means the term is not satisfy the distributed property okay in the same way even dogs is also not distributed that means in the particular affirmative both subject and predicates are not distributed in the universal affirmative subject is distributed in the particular affirmative both are not distributed in the universal affirmative here predicate is not distributed and what is the third one universal negative what is the universal negative no cat is dog okay uh, i am going to explain here right universal negative here no cat is dog now suppose if i want to uh, write draw a venn diagram no cat is dog how to write down this is the cat and this is a dog okay now suppose i want to expand this cats what happen this is a possible this is a possible but this is not a possible why because what is the condition no cat is dog suppose i expand like this then what happen it cuts the dogs is it valid it's not a valid that means certain limitation is there if any term has a limitation that means that the term satisfy the distributed property here in the universal negative both subject and predicates are distributed and what is the last one that is the universe particular negative what is the particular negative here some cats or some cats or not dogs in the particular negative what happened subject is not distributed but predicate is distributed subject is not distributed but predicate is distributed okay you must remember this one here it is very simple universal affirmative particular affirmative universal negative particular negative subject and predicate now in the universal affirmative in the universal affirmative subject is distributed but predicate is not distributed in the universal affirmative subject is distributed but predicate is not distributed in the particular affirmative both subject and predicates are not distributed in the universal negative both subject and predicates are distributed in the particular negative subject is not distributed but predicate is distributed okay just to remember this table that's enough and suppose if you remember this one it is very easy to identify the exact answer ओके इनीशियल का कुछ टफ फन बिजनेस नहीं कारण मैं मल्ली मल्ले दे चुका हूँ मेरे जस्ट ये थ्री वीडियोस प्रैक्टिस 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 ऐसे मात्रों नो नीड टू ड्राइव डायग्राम डायरेक्ट का मेरा आंसर फाइंड आउट चाहिए चुन ओके नॉट ओनली टू स्टेटमेंट्स टू कंक्लुशंस इवन थ्री स्टेटमेंट्स एंड � we derive the conclusion from two statements. Okay, what do you do here? You will have to waste your Venn diagram. Venn diagram waste your Venn diagram. Without using Venn diagram, you will have to explain it. Okay, now. Here, all cats or dogs, all rats or monkeys. Here, two statements. Okay, here, two statements. And next, how many conclusions are there? Total eight conclusions are there. Here two statements and how many conclusions are there? Eight conclusions. Okay. All cats or dogs. Cats and dogs. All rats or monkeys. All rats or monkeys. Is it valid? 
this is a valid here cats and dogs here this is the rats and this is the monkeys that is valid and next here cats dogs rats and monkeys that is also valid next this is also valid cats dogs rats monkeys if you go to like this you will get 15 venn diagram 15 different venn diagrams are possible here i draw just only 1 2 3 4 only 4 after drawing 15 diagrams then only you need to find the answer what is the exact answer okay now in our property just observe First, you check whether there is a common term in between these two statements. What is the common term? Either subject or predicate. All cats or dogs. What is the subject? Cats. What is the predicate? Dogs. All rats or monkeys. What is the subject? Rats. What is the predicate? That is monkey. Is there any common term in between these two statements? There is no common term. If there is no common term, there is no mediate inference. Suppose if you want to derive the mediate inference, you need to one middle term, one common term. One common term is called as a middle term. If the middle term is not exist, there is no mediate inference. No need to draw a Venn diagram also. Just to observe, all cats are dogs, all rats are monkeys. First, you check whether there is a common term in between these two statements. There is no common term. So, there is no mediate inference. Is it clear? Right. This is the first case. Now, go to the next case. Here, all cats or dogs, all rats or dogs. All cats are dogs and all rats are dogs. What is the common term in between these two statements? That is equal to dogs. So, common term is there. So, common term is there. Now we will check whether mediate inference is satisfied or not. Now I want to draw a Venn diagram. I want to draw a Venn diagram for these two statements. See, all cats are dogs. How to represent all cats are dogs? Cats and dogs. All rats are dogs. So, all rats are dogs. That is a valid. Cats, rats, and dogs. This is a valid. All cats are dogs. All rats, rats are dogs. Cats, rats, dogs. This is a valid. Rats, cats, dogs. That is also valid. All cats are dogs and all rats are dogs. Cats, rats, dogs. This is also valid. Cats, rats, dogs. This is also valid. All are unique. You said all. Suppose all are equal sets. All the three sets are equal sets. Then what happened? Here. Cats rats and dogs so this is also valid okay any more valid that's it and next one more thing rats cats and dogs suppose here only two statements here total eight venn diagrams are there total eight venn diagrams are there now we will check which of these eight conclusions are valid first one is all cats are rats in this case valid all cats are rats in this case valid all cats are rats this case valid but in this case all cats are rats here valid but what about this case all cats are rats is not a valid here not valid here not valid here not valid that means if any conclusion is not a valid in a at least single aspect that is not a valid mediate inference. <coughs> Sorry. Is conclusion 
ఏ కంక్లూజన్ అయినా సరే మనకి ఏ ఒక్క ఛాన్స్ ఏ ఒక్క పాసిబిలిటీలో కానీ మనకి వ్యాలిడ్ కాకపోతే దట్ ఈస్ నాట్ ఏ వ్యాలిడ్ కంక్లూజన్ ఇక్కడ మనం ఏంటి ఎయిట్ వెండగ్రామ్స్ వేసాం టూ స్టేట్మెంట్స్ లో ఈ ఎయిట్ వెండగ్రామ్స్ లో కూడా ఫస్ట్ వన్ ఏంటి మనకి వ్యాలిడ్ కాలేదు నా గో టు ద సెకండ్ వన్ ఆల్ రాట్స్ ఆర్ క్యాట్స్ ఇన్ దిస్ కేస్ ఇట్స్ నాట్ ఎ వ్యాలిడ్ ఆల్ రాట్స్ ఆర్ క్యాట్స్ ఇట్స్ ఎ వ్యాలిడ్ ఆల్ రాట్స్ ఆర్ క్యాట్స్ ఇట్స్ నాట్ వ్యాలిడ్ ఆల్ రాట్స్ ఆర్ క్యాట్స్ హియర్ వ్యాలిడ్ ఇయర్ నో నాట్ ఎ వ్యాలిడ్ నో క్యాట్ ఇస్ రాట్ రైట్ ఇయర్ నాట్ వ్యాలిడ్ ఇయర్ వ్యాలిడ్ ఇయర్ వ్యాలిడ్ in this case not valid next in this case not valid that's enough and in this case also not a valid a single aspect la valid kagapaina that is not a valid conclusion or not so second one is also not a valid conclusion two statements i draw eight venn diagrams all possibilities but first two conclusions are not a valid conclusions now go to the third one what is the third one some cats are rats here valid 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 here valid here valid but in this case is not a valid out of eight venn diagrams seven diagrams valid but in the one diagram it's not a valid what is the statement if any concave if any term if uh, any conclusion is not a valid in at least single aspect that is not a valid conclusion a vokka aspect la satisfy kakapaina that is not a valid conclusion so third one is not a valid conclusion for these two statements now go to the fourth one some rats are cats here valid 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 here valid here valid here valid but what about this case no rat is cat so in this case it's not a valid so what happened that is a, that is not a valid conclusion manaki exam lo suppose ee venn diagram miss chesam ankonde em chestam mana ee rendu kuda valid conclusions antam ఓకే జస్ట్ ఈ ఒక్క వెండగ్రామ్ మిస్ చేసినా సరే అవుట్ ఆఫ్ ఎయిట్ వెండగ్రామ్స్ లో సపోజ్ ఇఫ్ యూ స్కిప్ ద దిస్ వెండగ్రామ్ నో క్యాట్ ఇస్ రాట్ దెన్ వాట్ హ్యాపెన్ దీస్ టూ కంక్లూషన్స్ ఆర్ వ్యాలిడ్ బట్ ఇఫ్ యూ రైట్ డౌన్ దిస్ వన్ దెన్ ఓన్లీ యూ విల్ నో దీస్ టూ కంక్లూషన్స్ ఆర్ నాట్ ఎ వ్యాలిడ్ నేను మీకు అందుకే చెప్తున్నాను మీ వెండగ్రామ్స్ వేస్తే ఇక్కడ ఇనీషియల్ గా చాలా ఈజీగా ఉంటుంది కానీ ఎగ్జామ్ లోకి వచ్చేసరికి మాత్రం చాలా ప్రాబ్లం అవుతుంది మనకు కావాల్సింది ఏంటి మనం ఎలా చేస్తున్నాం కాదు మనకి ఎగ్జాక్ట్ ఆన్సర్ వస్తుందా లేదా అదే ఇంపార్టెంట్ ఓకే నవ్ నో క్యాట్ ఈజ్ రాట్ సి నో క్యాట్ ఈజ్ రాట్ ఈజ్ అ వ్యాలిడ్ బట్ వాట్ అబౌట్ ద రెస్ట్ ఆఫ్ దీస్ సెవెన్ సారీ వాట్ ఈస్ ద రెస్ట్ ఆఫ్ దీస్ సెవెన్ ఇస్ నాట్ ఎ వ్యాలిడ్ ఎక్సెప్ట్ దిస్ కేస్ ఇఫ్ యూ చూజ్ ఎనీ అదర్ వన్ డైగ్రామ్ ద that one is not a valid conclusion okay so no cat is rat is not a valid conclusion no rat is cat in this case it's a valid but what are the remaining cases it's not a valid so second one sixth one is also not a valid conclusion next some cats are not rats here all cats are rats is not a valid all cats are rats here valid all cats are here rats is not a valid some cats are rats here valid here not valid here valid here valid here valid but in this three cases is not a valid so what happened some cats are rats is also not a valid conclusion just strike of this next some rats are cats some rats are not cats here suppose if you choose this part some rats are not cats is valid in this case not valid in this case valid in this case not valid 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 not valid not valid so what happened even the eighth statement also not a valid conclusion in the eighth statement is also not a valid conclusion 
here only two statements are there. But out of these eight conclusions are not a valid immediate inferences. No need to draw a Venn diagram. So how to find the answer? Just look at glance. See, I already explained the distributive property in the universal affirmative subject is distributed, but predicate is not distributed. In the universal affirmative, subject is distributed, but predicate is not distributed. Of these two statements, what is the common term? That is the dog. Common term or middle term? That is dog. Is it distributed? No. There is no conclusion. So, Ikramari intended two statements use in Apudu. Two statements first six tells Nandi, middle term unnada leda. What is the middle term? That is the common term. Yes. Unte conclusion to the leda ante, leave it. Go to the next question. Next Nandi, middle term distribute I in the leda. At least wakasa distribute in a problem. Leda. Distribute kakapote, that is not a valid conclusion. That means middle term must be distributed at least once in the statement. Statement or premises, whatever it is. If the middle term is not distributed in both of the statements, that is not a valid conclusion. There is no valid conclusion. That's enough. Okay, no need to draw this entire one diagram. Right? Now, go to the next one. Same, all cats are dogs, all dogs are rats. Now, first term chat them. Middle term unda. Yes, middle term and common term undi. Next shell sendi distribute aina. Your cats, dogs, dogs, rats. Universal affirmative subject is distributed, predicate is not distributed. So cats is distributed, dogs not distributed. Dogs distributed, rats not distributed. What is the middle term? Dogs. Is it distributed? Yes. Now, conclusion may be exist. Now, check which of these eight conclusions are valid. First, to draw a Venn diagram. Okay, I'm going to explain both cases. All cats are dogs. Next, all dogs are rats. Cats, dogs, and rats. Next, cats, dogs, rats. Next, cats, dogs, and rats. Next, cats, dogs, and rats. Here, two statements, but we have four Venn diagrams. Make an example of Chalma in even a channel of Chusun Targada, a danger surrender. Okay, okay, one diagram we see, don't let me answer to this, sir. Okay, at the end of the name, Chesna, sir, then solution there is in the continent, one diagram we see, sir, sir. Can you, but, man, check, Charles, that day, only as per such, check, Charles. And the Grinch, one diagram, it is not suggestible, and it is. Okay, no? Now, here, we observe, which of these conclusions are valid. What is the first one? All cats are rats. All cats are rats. In this case, valid. In this case, valid. In this case, valid. And in this case, valid. So each and every conclusion, it's a valid. a single conclusion valid that is not a valid conclusion. So what happened? All cats are rats. That is a valid immediate inference inference or conclusion both are same okay na? so ekka chodandi middle term enti dogs distribute ayindi so first conclusion valid ayindi that's it now we will check which of the remaining conclusion which one of the remaining conclusions are valid what is the next one some rats or cats in this case it's not a valid here Middle term is distributed, but in this case, not a valid. In this case, it's not a valid. In this case, it's not a valid. Only this case valid. But then we can check 
ఏ ఒక్క ఆస్పెక్ట్ లో సాటిస్ఫై కాకపోయినా దట్ ఈస్ నాట్ ఎ వ్యాలిడ్ కంక్లూజన్ సో వాట్ హ్యాపెన్ ద సెకండ్ వన్ ఈస్ నాట్ ఎ వ్యాలిడ్ కంక్లూజన్ ద సెకండ్ వన్ ఈస్ నాట్ ఎ వ్యాలిడ్ కంక్లూజన్ నౌ గో టు ద థర్డ్ వన్ వాట్ ఈస్ ద థర్డ్ వన్ సమ్ క్యాట్స్ ఆర్ రాట్స్ here all cats are rats means some cats are rats or not so that is a valid here some cats are rats here valid some cats are rats here valid some cats are rats here valid in each and every aspect that is a valid conclusion so what is the second what is the third one it's a valid mediate inference now go to the fourth one what is the fourth one some rats or cats some rats or cats see what is the intersection part this is the cats and rats as well so some rats or cats valid here valid here valid and here also valid that means in each and every case that is a valid conclusion so what happen some rats or cats is a valid mediate inference see the difference between previous case and this case in the previous case here middle term not distributed so none of these eight conclusions are valid but what about this case here middle term is distributed here first one third one and fourth one are valid conclusions now go to the fifth one what is the fifth one no cat is rat if you observe all cats are rats if you take any venn diagram all cats are cats all cats are rats but what is the conclusion here no cat is rat so what happened this is not a valid conclusion in the same way no rat is a cat next one uh, some uh, cats are not rats some cats are not rats if you observe this venn diagram all cats are rats మీకు ఏం చెప్తున్నాను ఏ సింగిల్ ఆస్పెక్ట్ లో సాటిస్ఫై కాకపోయినా దట్ ఈస్ నాట్ ఏ వ్యాలిడ్ కంక్లూజన్ సో స్ట్రైట్ అవే క్యాన్సిల్ దిస్ వన్ ఇయర్ సమ్ రాట్స్ ఆర్ సమ్ క్యాట్స్ ఆర్ నాట్ రాట్స్ దట్ ఈస్ నాట్ ఏ వ్యాలిడ్ అండ్ వాట్ ఈస్ ద నెక్స్ట్ వన్ సమ్ రాట్స్ ఆర్ నాట్ క్యాట్స్ ఇఫ్ యూ అబ్జర్వ్ ఇన్ దిస్ వెన్ డైగ్రామ్ ఆల్ రాట్స్ ఆర్ క్యాట్స్ బట్ వాట్ అబౌట్ దిస్ ఎయిత్ వన్ సమ్ రాట్స్ ఆర్ నాట్ క్యాట్స్ సో దిస్ వన్ ఆల్సో not a valid conclusion see here two statements are there and eight conclusions of these two statement four venn diagrams are possible but only three venn diagrams so only three conclusions are valid what is the condition see if you observe in the universal affirm whatever the distributed properties cats distributed predicate is not distributed rats not distributed rats cats both are not distributed both are distributed subject is not distributed and predicate is distributed see you must remember if both of the statements are particular conclusion must be particular sorry if both of the statements is affirmative or positive conclusion must be positive so no need to check from 5th to 8th why because those conclusions are negative conclusions either particular conclusions or particular negative or universal negative whatever it is if both the statements are affirmative or positive the conclusion is also positive no need to draw a venn diagram just to cross all these four now of these four conclusions the second one is not a valid why see in the first one subject cats distributed in the statement also cats distributed in the second one rats distributed but in the statement rats is not distributed what is the meaning if any term is distributed in the conclusion that term must be distributed in the statement that's it if any term is distributed in the conclusion the term must be distributed in the statement then only that is a valid conclusion ikkada nenu cheptunanu conclusion lo edanna term distribute aithe statement lo compulsory avvali 
అదే కంక్లూజన్ లో డిస్ట్రిబ్యూట్ కాకపోతే స్టేట్మెంట్ లో అవుతుందా అవ్వలేదా మనకి దాని సంబంధమే లేదు కంక్లూజన్ లో ఏదైనా టర్న్ డిస్ట్రిబ్యూట్ అయితే స్టేట్మెంట్ లో డిస్ట్రిబ్యూట్ అయితే రాలి అది ఒక్కడే గుర్తుంచుకోండి ఓకే హియర్ రాట్స్ ఈజ్ డిస్ట్రిబ్యూటెడ్ ఇన్ ద కంక్లూజన్ బట్ రాట్స్ ఈజ్ నాట్ డిస్ట్రిబ్యూటెడ్ ఇన్ ద స్టేట్మెంట్ సో దట్ ఈస్ నాట్ ఎ వ్యాలిడ్ ఓకే హియర్ ఎన్ని ప్రాపర్టీస్ నేర్చుకున్నాం మిడిల్ టర్న్ మస్ట్ బి దేర్ ఇన్ ద కంక్లూజన్ ఫస్ట్ వన్ నెక్స్ట్ మిడిల్ టర్న్ మస్ట్ బి డిస్ట్రిబ్యూట్ అట్లీస్ట్ వన్స్ ఇన్ ద స్టేట్మెంట్ దట్ ఈస్ ద సెకండ్ వన్ అండ్ ద థర్డ్ వన్ అండి ఇఫ్ ఎనీ టర్మ్ ఈజ్ డిస్ట్రిబ్యూటెడ్ ఇన్ ద కంక్లూజన్ ద టర్మ్ మస్ట్ బి డిస్ట్రిబ్యూటెడ్ ఇన్ ద స్టేట్మెంట్ ఓకే అండ్ ద ఇంపార్టెంట్ పాయింట్ మిడిల్ టర్మ్ షుడ్ నాట్ బి దేర్ ఇన్ ద కంక్లూజన్ కంక్లూ స్టేట్మెంట్ లో మిడిల్ టర్మ్ ఏదైనా ఉంటే ఆ మిడిల్ టర్మ్ అనేది కంక్లూజన్ లో ఉండకూడదు ఇవన్నీ కూడా నేను లిస్ట్ అప్ చేస్తున్నాను నథింగ్ టు వరీ జస్ట్ అబ్జర్వ్ కేర్ఫుల్లీ దర్శన ఆఫ్ నెక్స్ట్ గో టు ద నెక్స్ట్ వన్ సమ్ క్యాట్స్ ఆర్ డాగ్స్ అండ్ ఆల్ డాగ్స్ ఆర్ ర్యాడ్స్ ఇక్కడ మీరు అబ్జర్వ్ చేయాల్సింది ఏంటంటే ఇఫ్ ఎనీ వన్ ఆఫ్ ది స్టేట్మెంట్ ఈజ్ పర్టికులర్ ద కంక్లూజన్ మస్ట్ బి పర్టికులర్ so this is not a valid this is not a valid this is not a valid and this is also not a valid next if both of the statements are affirmative conclusion is also affirmative affirmative and ante positive okay so this is not a valid and this is not a valid no need to draw a diagram here if any one of the statement is particular conclusion must be particular before that here cats not distributed dogs not distributed dogs distributed rats not distributed what is the middle term dogs is distributed in the second statement so conclusion may be exist okay now these two are valid why these two are valid here both the terms are not distributed inna meeku em cheppanu కంక్లూజన్ లో ఏదైనా ఒక టర్మ్ డిస్ట్రిబ్యూట్ అయితే స్టేట్మెంట్ లో కంపల్సరీ అవ్వాలి కంక్లూజన్ లో డిస్ట్రిబ్యూట్ కాకపోతే దాని గురించి ఆలోచించాల్సిన అవసరమే లేదు నో నీ టు డ్రా డైగ్రామ్ ఇయర్ సమ్ క్యాట్స్ ఆర్ డాగ్స్ రైక్ దిస్ క్యాట్స్ అండ్ డాగ్స్ అండ్ ఆల్ డాగ్స్ ఆర్ రాట్స్ ఇయర్ వ్యాలిడ్ అండ్ నెక్స్ట్ ఇయర్ క్యాట్స్ డాగ్స్ అండ్ రాట్స్ దిస్ ఇస్ వ్యాలిడ్ నెక్స్ట్ క్యాట్స్ డాగ్స్ and rats okay this is also valid but no need to draw a diagram just observe carefully if any one of the statement is a particular conclusion must be particular so universal conclusion sunny stack up chesandi avasaram ledhi manaki only particular conclusion a check cheyandi tarvata here if both the statements are positive conclusion must be positive so negative conclusion sunny stack up chesandi only rende untai అది చెక్ చేస్తే చాలు ఓకే నో నీట్ టు డ్రా ఎ డయాగ్రామ్ ఇక్కడ మన ప్రాపర్టీస్ ఏవే నేర్చుకున్నాం మిడిల్ టర్మ్ మస్ట్ బి దేర్ ఇన్ ద కంక్లూజన్ మిడిల్ టర్మ్ మస్ట్ బి డిస్ట్రిబ్యూటెడ్ అట్లీస్ట్ వన్స్ ఇన్ ద స్టేట్మెంట్ మిడిల్ టర్మ్ షుడ్ నాట్ బి దేర్ ఇన్ ద కంక్లూజన్ నెక్స్ట్ ఇఫ్ ఎనీ టర్మ్ ఈజ్ డిస్ట్రిబ్యూటెడ్ ఇన్ ద కంక్లూజన్ ద టర్మ్ మస్ట్ బి డిస్ట్రిబ్యూటెడ్ ఇన్ ద స్టేట్మెంట్ and what next if any statement is a particular the conclusion must be particular okay let's go to the next one in the same way if any one of the statement is negative the conclusion must be negative so strike of all four conclusions no need to check this said next middle term must be distributed cats distributed dogs not distributed dog and rat distributed so middle term is distributed now if any one of the statement is negative the conclusion must be negative so now you check which of these conclusions are valid what is the third property if any term is distributed in the conclusion the term must be distributed in the statement your cat and rat distributed in the statements so in the conclusion your cats and rats distributed in the statement also so this is a valid conclusion and this is also a valid conclusion next some cats or not rats 
in the universal in the particular negative subject is not distributed but predicate is distributed rats is distributed in the conclusion and statements as well so this is a valid conclusion and rats is not distributed cats is distributed cats is distributed in the statement as well so this is also a valid conclusion okay so uh, here fifth sixth seventh eighth all four conclusions are valid okay that means if any one of the statement is negative, the conclusion must be negative. And last two properties are very simple. Yes. If one statement is particular and the statement is negative, the conclusion must be negative. Okay. If any one of the statement is particular, conclusion must be particular. So, strike off all these four. If any one of the statement is negative, Conclusion must be negative. So, strike of these two. So, now you check which of these two conclusions are valid. Cats, dogs, dogs, rats. Here, Milton is distributed. Rats is distributed in the conclusion, in the statements as well. So, this is a valid conclusion. Here, rats is distributed in the conclusion and statement as well. So, this is a valid conclusion. So, if one of the statement is particular and the statement is negative, the conclusion must be particular negative. Next, if both the statements are particular, there is no immediate inference, no need to draw a diagram. In your examination, in your question, if both statements are particular, then straight away write down no conclusion. There is no conclusion. That's it. Go to the next one. So, in Mikada Japan. One second answer find out system. Not only this one, if both statements are negative, there is no conclusion. So compulsor out of file, at least two questions are like this. Shodagana answer find out choice. Just one or two seconds. Okay. Next, remaining three, maximum 30 seconds. Ante. And different syllogisms three videos observe matrimony. Practice check with the matram and women chalem. Adimato Gurtunch Kondi. Okay. Right. Now, just at a glance, I'm going to explain all the properties. All of you note down. Just pause this video and note down this, uh, as these statements. Okay. And or take a screenshot of this one. Middle term must be there in the statement. Middle term must be distributed at least once in the statement. Middle term should not be there in the conclusion. Next, if any term is distributed in the conclusion, the term must be distributed in the statement. If any one of the statement is particular, the conclusion must be particular. If any one of the statement is negative, the conclusion must be negative. If both the statements are the particular, there is no conclusion. If both of the statements are negative, there is no conclusion. Next, if one of the statement is particular, the other statement is negative, the conclusion may be particular negative. This is the immediate inference. Okay, based on this immediate inference, we are going to solve the questions. Okay, only immediate inference matha check chestam. third video lo at a time immediate. Mediate and complement repair check them. Okay, now right. Now go to the first one. Some players or singers. All equally immediate chatter, only immediate mathrama chessan. Already immediate man chessam. Same questions ki. E put the same questions ki immediate chadam. Same questions ki complementary chesi. Okay, sir. Immediate, immediate and complementary pair chadam. Okay, na? Right. Some players or singers, all singers are tall. Middle term munda? Yes, middle term is there. What is the next conclusion? What is the next property? Middle term must be distributed at least once in the statement. Yes, middle term singers is there. Next. Middleton should not be there in the conclusion. Now, 
if any one of the statement is particular what is the conclusion must be particular so second conclusion is not a valid no need to check that one okay as a van der gram ayna asal led if any one of the statement is particular the conclusion must be particular so strike of this one some players are tall what is the distributive property in the particular affirmative both subject and predicates are not distributed nen meek em cheppanu fourth property if any term is distributed in the conclusion the term must be distributed in the statement ikkada ee two terms distribute kaledu so this is a valid mediate inference answer padutundandi just ila observe chesi man cheyochu okay na so nothing to worry jagratha observe cheyandi fast ga vaddu step by step cool ga cheyandi third question third video ki vachesariki matram man fast ga cheyagalam next ikkada observe cheyandi man immediate inference matrame chestunnam immediate inference cheyatam ledhu okay next ikkada observe chese if both statements are particular if both of the statements are particular what happen there is no mediate inference leave it go to the next question that's it ante inga mana venn diagrams veyadam kani chodadam kani emi avasaram ledhu next if one statement is particular and the statement is negative what is the conclusion particular negative is there any particular negative conclusion no so there is no mediate inference go to the next one answer padutundandi only one second kada right other chain em problem led if one of the statement is particular and the statement is negative conclusion must be particular negative there is no particular negative conclusion just like of that one go to the next one fourth one chuddam both statements are particular so what happened there is no mediate inference ikka man mediate inference maatrame chustunam both are particular there is no mediate inference no need to draw a diagram go to the next one all stones are water some water or clean what is the middle term water next enti distribute ayindale check cheyandi all stones are water in the universal affirmative subject is distributed predicate is not distributed here in the particular affirmative both subject and predicates are not distributed what is the middle term water is it distributed no so if the middle term is not distributed there is no mediate inference just observe carefully you will get the answer okay next all keys are locks all locks are screws what is the middle term locks is there next and avali middle term must be distribute at least once in the statement here subject is distributed predicate is not distributed subject is distributed predicate is not not distributed why because in the universal affirmative subject is distributed but predicate is not distributed okay now what is the middle term locks is distributed now go to the conclusion in the universal affirmative subject is distributed but predicate is not distributed here the term screws is distributed in the conclusion what about the statement is not distributed what is the fourth property if any term is distributed in the conclusion the term must be distributed in the statement so this is not a valid conclusion next some locks or keys what is the middle term locks what is the property middle term should not be there in the conclusion here middle term is there so this is not a valid mediate inference ok marasa cheptunanu ikka mana chestundi entante mediate maatrame immediate kaadu immediate la adi valid avutundi okay so mediate maatrame check chestunamu so sixth conclusion not satisfy in the mediate inference 
next go to the seventh one here one statement is particular in the statement is negative what is the conclusion particular negative is there any particular negative conclusion no so there is no immediate inference for the seventh one leave it go to the next one answer parthundi it's a very simple andi kan but entante meer practice cheyali practice aithe matram synonyms is a very simple otherwise it's very difficult next all dogs are monkeys no monkey is a cat if any one of the statement is negative conclusion must be negative is now here all dogs are monkeys no monkey is a cat in the universal affirmative subject is distributed predicate is not distributed in the universal negative both subject and predicates are distributed okay now no dog is cat no cat is dog what is the middle term monkeys it not exist in the conclusion yes these two may be valid yet the term dog is distributed in the conclusion and the statement also distributed the cat is distributed in the conclusion and statement as well here also cat is distributed in the conclusion and statement as well and the dog is distributed in the conclusion and statement as well so what happened both conclusions are valid mediate inferences both conclusions are valid mediate inferences that's it right now go to the ninth one here one of these statement is particular the conclusion must be particular so strike off the first one no need to check mediate inference only what is the middle term watches is distributed right Next, some guns or phones. Here, two terms are not distributed. What is the fourth property? If any one of the statement is, if any, if any term is distributed in the conclusion, the term must be distributed in the statement. Here, both terms are not distributed, so that is a valid conclusion. That's it. Next. Tenth one. If any one of this statement is particular, so the conclusion must be particular. So these two. Let us check. What is the middle term? Airplanes is it distributed? No. So there is no immediate inference for the tenth question. Go to the eleventh one. Next. All cars are cats. All fans are cats. So what is the middle term? cats is it distributed no so there is no immediate inference go to the next question that's it next some scooters are trucks all trucks are trains here the term some particular so even conclusion is also particular so no need to check the second one just to focus on the first one only some scooters are trains but you need to check whether the middle term is distributed in the statement or not yes what is the middle term trucks is distributed next trucks is not uh, trucks is not in the conclusion yet yeah, these two terms are not distributed so some scooters or trains is a valid conclusion right go to the next one here all pencils are pens no pen is a book if any one of the statement is negative the conclusion must be negative so second one is not a valid mediate inference mediate inference okay confuse avadu immediate veru mediate veru next no pencil is a book what is the middle term that is pen is not there in the conclusion pencil pen pen book okay no pencil is a book here both the terms are distributed in the conclusion and the statement as well so the first conclusion is a valid mediate inference next go to the fourth 14th one some rats or rabbits all rats are mosquitoes no need to check the negative conclusion why because both are affirmative 
now one statement is particular so conclusion must be particular what is the middle term rats is it distributed yes rats is distributed in the statement here conclusion both terms are not distributed so no need to check whether those two terms are distributed in the statement or not so first one is a valid mediate inference next all cups are all fans are cups all cups are fans fans distributed cups not distributed cups distributed pillows not distributed milton cups so milton should not be there in the conclusion now this is a very important one all fans are pillows so first one is a valid mediate inference all pillows are fans your pillows is distributed in the conclusion but not distributed in the statement so this is not a valid conclusion what is the fourth property if any term is distributed in the conclusion the term must be distributed in the statement roma is a brilliant roma is a women women is a brilliant here both are particular if both the statements are particular then what happened there is no mediate inference leave it go to the next one no need to check no need to draw a diagram next go to the 17th one some stones are bricks some bricks are stones both are particular there is no mediate inference ante meer ala vachind anukondi just leave it go to the next case ante malli man diagram adi veyalsina avasaram led next one statement is particular in the statement is negative so conclusion must be negative so first one is not a valid next what is the middle term black is it distributed yes next middle term is not there in the statement that is also valid next white is not distributed green green is distributed in the conclusion and statement as well so what is the answer the second one is a valid mediate inference okay now go to the 19th one all flowers are stems all stems are roots next all roots are flowers here roots is a distributed in the conclusion but not distributed in the statement so this is not a valid conclusion next stems what is the middle term stem what is the property middle term should not be there in the conclusion so this is not a valid conclusion leave it go to the next one in the next one both the statements are particular there is no conclusion leave it go to the next one 21st both conclusions are particular so there is no mediate inference for the 21st one that's it next middle term pencils not distributed so there is no mediate inference ikkada abdha chudandi middle term distribute kaledu no conclusion go to the next one ent em padutundandi maximum one second nen meeku em cheptunanu ఇవి ప్రాపర్టీస్ పర్ఫెక్ట్ గా కానీ నేర్చుకున్నారు అంటే ఫైవ్ క్వశ్చన్స్ లెస్ దాన్ టూ మినిట్స్ ఇంకా ఫాస్ట్ గా చేయగలిగితే ఫైవ్ క్వశ్చన్స్ లెస్ దాన్ వన్ మినిట్ లో చేయచ్చు మనకి ఏంటంటే మనకి ఫార్టీ క్వశ్చన్స్ మా అయితే ట్వంటీ మినిట్స్ టైం ఉంటుంది సిలో ఫైవ్ క్వశ్చన్స్ ఉన్నాయి అనుకోండి ఫైవ్ క్వశ్చన్స్ వన్ మినిట్ లో చేశారు అంటే రిమైనింగ్ థర్టీ ఫైవ్ క్వశ్చన్స్ నైన్టీ మినిట్స్ దానికి టైం యూస్ చేసుకోవచ్చు కదా అది మైండ్ లో పెట్టుకోండి నెక్స్ట్ ట్వంటీ థర్డ్ వన్ మిడిల్ టర్న్ not distributed there is no mediate inference go to the next one okay next one bricks yes here middle term is distributed next middle term should not be there in the conclusion so strike up the second one why because bricks is a middle term now you check the first one only pencil and bottle in this conclusion pencil is distributed this term is distributed in the statement also 
so what happened the first one is a valid mediate inference okay now just at a glance i am going to explain once again what is the distributive property you need to remember this table in the universal affirmative in the universal affirmative subject is distributed predicate is not distributed in the particular affirmative both subject and predicates are not distributed in the universal negative both subject and predicates are distributed in the particular negative subject is not distributed but predicate is distributed okay next whatever the properties middle term must be there in the statement second one middle term must be distributed at least once in the statement third one middle term should not be there in the conclusion fourth one if any term is distributed in the conclusion the term must be distributed in the statement fifth one if any one of the statement is particular the conclusion must be particular sixth one if any one of the statement is negative the conclusion must be negative now if one of the statement is particular and the statement is negative the conclusion must be particular negative next if both of the statements are particular there is no conclusion if both of the statements are negative there is no conclusion right this is about the mediate inference in the third video i am going to explain complementary pair and how to solve syllogisms at a time ante enti at a time ante immediate mediate and complementary moodu oke sari ela apply cheyal anedi third video lo discuss cheyadam okay but ee first and second videos meer maatram baaga practice chestane third video easy avutundi led anukondi edo just fake gala chuse odile sari ante maatram dan valli use ayithe emi ledhu malli meer venn diagram cheskodam daniki time kill cheskonu avutundi ee at least వీడియోస్ చూసిన తర్వాత అట్లీస్ట్ త్రీ అవర్ ఫోర్ త్రీ ఆర్ ఫోర్ అవర్స్ టైం మీరు ఆర్ఎస్ అగర్వాల్ చూస్తారో లేకపోతే బ్యాంకింగ్ సర్వీస్ కానుకలు చూస్తారో లేకపోతే టెక్స్ట్ బుక్ చూస్తారో మీ ఇష్టం ఏదైనా సరే మీ మెటీరియల్ చాయిస్ ఇవ్వచ్చు దాంట్లో ఉన్న క్వశ్చన్స్ మీద ఫోకస్ చేసి కరెక్ట్గా సాల్వ్ చేయండి వెంటగ్రామ్స్ వేయకుండా ఆన్సర్ క్రాస్ చెక్ చేసుకోండి యు విల్ గెట్ ద హన్ సెంట్ పర్సన్ కరెక్ట్ ఓకే ద సర్ ఇన్ దిస్ వీడియో విల్ మీట్ అగైన్ ఇన్ ద నెక్స్ట్ వీడియో